Hello, everybody. Welcome to Own the Road with Auto Trader. It is our new podcast and webcast series, and we're so excited to be here. My name is Jody Lyon. I'm the editor in chief of Auto Trader. And I'm Dan Alika. I am Auto Trader's road test editor. And so, Own the Road with Auto Trader. Our tagline for this podcast is making car stuff simple for Canadians. So, that is exactly what you can expect on the show. Yeah, we really thought, you know, how do we simplify things? Um, not to dumb it down, that's not what we mean at all. We just understand that for probably the vast majority of people out there, you know, they aren't enthusiasts, but cars are a big part of their lives. For sure. And we know that there are a lot of other automotive podcasts out there. Um, I feel like sometimes they're a little bit too nerdy. You really have to be like, it's like inside baseball. You really have to know what's going on to understand what they're talking about. Um, and even me, I've been covering the automotive industry for like a dozen years now, which makes me feel very old to say that. But if I pick up a traditional car magazine or listen to one of those podcasts, like I don't know what they're talking about half the time. So if even I can get confused with stuff like that, I can imagine that this must sound like gobbledygook to a lot of people. So we're trying to explain car things, demystify it, make it easier to understand from everybody, from like a casual everyday driver to a first time car buyer all the way up to an automotive enthusiast. Absolutely, yeah. And, you know, I mean, I think that it's time for that shameless plug. You know, we have a whole host of content on autotrader.ca slash editorial as well as a YouTube channel. Um, and that's kind of the mantra that we've carried across all of that content, right, is just to simplify it, to make it easy to read, to make it digestible. And so this just makes sense. It's like that natural step, a new form of content that, hey, as the name might suggest, you could be listening to this in the car, you know, on your drive to work or to the cottage or whatever. Uh, and we just want to, you know, make it a friendly, conversational sort of take on the news, what matters to you, you know, what we're driving. There's so much to cover, um, but we don't want to do it in a, in a stuffy or, you know, really kind of nerdy way. Just make it simple. Yeah. So what Dan and I are here to do, and it's kind of our mission statement from all the content that we make, um, is to, to give you just honest, unbiased, expert automotive advice. We think we're really good at it, um, and we kind of pride ourselves on being able to explain things in a way that like everybody can understand. I don't want anything to be confusing. Um, and if there's ever a time where we, we start nerding out and you start not to understand what we're talking about, call us out on it. Let us know because we'll rein that in. I never want anybody to feel confused by what we're talking about. That's really important to me. Yeah, and you know, my take uh, in my time at Trader has been that, you know, I answer to my bosses, which is- Which is me. Jody. But, you know, I'm beholden to readers, viewers, and, and now listeners, right? And that really is uh, how I feel. My, my responsibility is to those people. And, you know, it's just that I answer to you. So, you know, we can do that same thing here, right? Is, is I want to make sure that the content that we're providing is useful uh, in, in ways more than just to, you know, spend 40 minutes on your drive to work with us. We'd love that. You're willing to do that, but we want to make sure that you're getting something out of it too. Yeah, I would love like if some if everyone listened to an episode and like left learning something new or understanding something better. Um, I just want to open up the car world to everybody because I know that it can be like kind of an old boys club sometimes. Um, and so I never want people to feel that way when no. they're listening to us. So this is for you. Everybody who has anything to do with cars. <laughs> Yeah, like, you know, what did I say? From nerds to normies? Yeah, it's we're little... like somewhere in between those two groups of people. Yeah. Um, like, I, I love cars. We're both very passionate about cars, but I would never call myself like a car enthusiast. Um, I don't actually do a lot of car stuff in my spare time outside of work, but I do love it. I'm like somewhere in between two, I think, you know, I definitely consider myself an enthusiast, but not in a, I, I never, you know, kind of shun people. Um, I never want to make people feel shut out from a conversation where it's like, oh, if you don't know the engine code from that, you know, 1995 <laughs> version of some niche car, then, yeah, then you're not in the club. That. Like, that's so silly to me. And, you know, so we want to make sure that, again, everything is just simplified, but still 
interesting, still entertaining. And, and so part of that is we're going to bring you guys some interviews, which is really cool because I'm sure, you know, you don't necessarily want to hear me talking all the time. Uh, so I some, don't. <laughs> some interesting people uh, from the industry, again, that bring, you know, value to, to the podcast. It's not just kind of, uh, you know, throwing stuff at the wall to see what sticks. It's like people that, that matter, people with, you know, opinions and, and advice that matters to you guys. Um, and then just, you know, general advice, answering questions, talking about, you know, what we're driving, talking about industry trends like electrification is a big one. You're it's not getting away one. from that. So yeah. And I mean, that's something that we know a lot of people have a lot of questions about. Um, it's very new. Oh, like a couple of years ago, Dan and I were new to the EV world too, but in doing our jobs, we've learned so much about it. And we want to share all of that information with you um, with the understanding that like we were also newbies once. And so I think that a lot of the stuff that we learned will be very useful. Um, and that's where you guys come in. So like we want to hear your questions. So I'll invite you to email us at expert at trader.ca with literally any question that is car related. There are no silly questions. It doesn't and always have to be car related. I mean, Foods? if you want to know what we like to eat or if you want to like pry into our personal music? lives, music, whatever, like that's on the table too, I would say. Our favorite road trip, you know, music song lists, whatever. Yeah, literally anything is on yeah. the table. And like, I really don't think there's any dumb questions. Like if you no. feel like embarrassed to ask a question, don't be because chances are if you have a question about something, somebody else probably has the exact same question. Yeah. And again, it's not shaming. We're not going to be like, oh, you know, like... <laughs> Chris Smart from Toronto wants to know, you know, it's not like that. It's going to be, you know, the just anonymous questions. But like Jody said, like, if you're asking, chances are there's someone somewhere across this fantastic country of ours that probably has the same question and we are happy to answer it or find the answer. Because that's the other thing is we're not going to pretend. We, you know, we are experts. We've been doing this a long time. But we're also journalists, so we're good at asking questions. Yeah. <laughs> I remember, you know, when I was in journalism school, that was something that was, you know, told to me, right? It's like there's an expectation that, you know, you, you know a little bit about everything. And that's something that I've always kind of, you know, taken with me is, is that, you know, there is that expectation, but I'm never afraid to admit when it's outside of my expertise, but I will do everything in my power to educate myself and then bring that, you know, to, to listeners, to viewers, because I think it's important, right? I can be that conduit for, you know, that kind of like education. Yeah, exactly. And so if you have questions about like what we drive, what we're driving currently, if you're in the market for a new car and you're cross shopping a couple options, we can help maybe narrow down the field for you. If you have questions about car maintenance, car buying process, we've got advice for you. So there's no bad questions. Please let us know and we'll try to answer a couple of them in every episode. Um, so here's what to expect. This episode's a little bit shorter because it's our introduction to Own the Road with Auto Trader. Usually there'll be about 40 minutes to an hour. We're going to come out with a new episode every other week. You can find it on YouTube, but also whatever regular podcast providers you go to. Um, we would love if you subscribed and liked our stuff because that would tell us that you're enjoying it. Um, and of course, we're open to feedback too. So if you have feedback for us, you can also email us at expert at trader.ca and we'll try to get better. Yeah, just want to chat? Email us. Yeah, you know, we've that's... got lots of spare time. We love chatting yeah. about stuff. Yeah, there's no limit to that inbox. You yeah, know? so I guess, yeah, that, that's our first half episode of Own the Road with Auto Trader. Thank you so much for joining us and we're so excited to hit you guys with our next episode, which was gonna be all about introduction to greener driving. Yeah, so electrification as well as kind of green driving tips. There's gonna be a lot of that. April is green month, I think is what it's called. That's true, yeah, April is green month. So we're gonna be focusing a lot of our content on fuel saving tips, EVs, plug-in hybrids, kind of what's the difference between all of that stuff, pros and cons of each. Um, so yeah, we thought why not just, you know, package that into a podcast episode. Perfect. So we'll catch you guys on the next episode. Thank you so See much. See you in a couple weeks. <laughs>